Hi everyone, I'm going to introduce you a quick and easy method of installing Drupal. It will be very handy for new Drupal students and anyone who is starting learning Drupal development. This method creates a server-like environment on your Mac including the database server, web server and PHP interpreter that Drupal needs. This procedure it doesn't make your website available to the web but it's very convenient so if you want to play with Drupal more freely without worrying about breaking a live site I'm going to install on my MacBook Pro using the same method with a slight variation you can install it on your Windows machine as well okay to start the installation process open your web browser and navigate to dev.aqr.com slash downloads you can use any browser so if you um, open this uh, web page you will see two links since I'm installing on MacBook so I'm going to click on Mac downloads just click allow so that uh, it can proceed with downloading the, the package file it's approximately 170 megabyte it will take uh, depending on your internet it will take some time wait for it to download okay, once downloaded double click the DMG file so that the installation process can start so once the media is uh, verified it will automatically go to the next process it will present you this window double click on uh, aqua dev desktop installer it will verify the app first and then prompt you to enter authorization to install the app click on open button and enter your password okay this window will show you the versions which are installed for apache mysql php and php myadmin click next leave it as is and move to the next step in this window you can select where you want to install the dev desktop I'm installing at the default location so clicking next move to the next window and you will uh, start the actual installation process where the installation method will copy all the files to your destination folder depending on your machine it may take between two to five minutes so wait for it to complete so once the installation is complete there will be a couple of more prompts and you will be able to open the Aqua Dev desktop click finish and there it is okay straight away you can see that Apache and MySQL are running and ready to serve your Drupal site okay there are three options I'm going to select the first one start from scratch the other ones are you can import website from uh, your uh, desktop or from aqua cloud okay I have selected the first option and I'm going to install a demo Drupal 9 version you can see all the distributions available for installation in this window if you scroll down and the first step to install the distribution is to click the link beside the distribution which you want to install on step 2 I'm not changing anything and clicking on next so since this process needs to write to the hard drive I need to basically give it uh, another authorization so entering my password and clicking OK so now the download process for that distribution has started okay depending on the size of the distribution it will take some time I think between two to five minutes depending on your internet okay looks like the process is complete and we have got our first uh, uh, Drupal site on our local environment uh, we have got the URL the code local database and PHP version you can change the PHP version from here so let's start uh, setting up our first Drupal site by going to this URL 
okay uh, select your language click next choose your profile standard demo I'm selecting demo so that we can have some data on your website so once you have made your decision click the save and continue button and it will start installing the Drupal uh, modules and database and other stuff it will take um, some time to complete it I'll fast forward it so since I'm installing a demo it contains Spanish translations as well uh, now it's downloading uh, those translations so once done you will be presented with um, a window to configure site variables uh, where you can give site name, email address, username for the admin and password email address for the admi administration account and some other variables so I'm just putting some demo data so once you're done entering all the info click next and this will finish the installation process and you will get your first site on your local environment which you can play with so this demo site is a very good um, place to start your um, learning for Drupal so if you come back to your Android desktop you will see your existing website and you can launch another one just by clicking on this button the process is very simple and you just need to click a few times that's it thank you for watching see you in another tutorial